Welcome back to Solid Cam Pro. In this exercise, we are going to create this 3D model in Inventor. As we see here, we have this drawing and we have these all dimensions we need in order to create our model. Uh, in this exercise, we are going to learn how to use some basic command for creating 3D model in Inventor. For example, we have these commands extrude, extrude cat, extrude up to next body, create plane in difference angle. As we see here, we have this isometric view, scale 1 to 1, and we have these dimensions from here to here, extrude 100, and the thickness 25. From this side, we have this thickness 40 millimeter, and we have this angle here, 20 degree from here to here, and for this one, 30 degree. And we have this cut out, we have these dimensions here. So let's start to create our model by creating sketch this side first. Select sketch from plane, draw a line. let's define this sketch 50 millimeter and this one 25 millimeter and this one 37.5 25 and from here to here we have 100 and from here to here 200 and this one 40 this one 60 and this one 100 and from here wait from here to here 10 millimeter hey. now our sketch is fully defined finish sketch select extrude command 100 select symmetric next step we are going to create this part here so let's create a plane with 20 degree from this surface select plane select this edge and select this surface just minus 20 like this okay now the angle from this surface to this plane is 20 degree create new sketch hide this plane select rectangle Okay. 
define from here to here 50 millimeter and this one 40 and this one 50 draw an arc from this point to this, to this point tangent 25 convert this line to a construction line draw a circle 25 millimeter in diameter and now finish the sketch select extrude command select this profile and select up to next up to next body here okay now make it visible this sketch select extrude command select this circle 15 millimeter upward okay as we see here 15 millimeter now we are going to create this hole. Hide this sketch. Select hole command. Select this surface and select this circle. In order to place this hole on the center of this circle. Diameter 12, it's okay. Through all. create this part here so let's create a new plane here select this edge and select this surface thirty degree so you see here okay create new sketch here this uh, plane select line fifty millimeter no in this direction select define this line 50 and in this line 50 select R command define from this line to this line 30 finish a sketch now select extrude Select up to next. Okay. And 
now here we are going to create some cutout we have this dimension we have from here to the center of this 50 millimeter because we have 10 millimeter this distance from here to here center is 5 from the center is 5 so we have total length is from here to here 50 and now we are going to create a circle here and this lines here so select this surface new sketch let's select circle select like this one 25 select offset command 5 millimeter in this direction and 5 millimeter in this direction 5 millimeter in this direction and 5 millimeter in this direction now delete the unnecessary line center now draw a line the same draw a line like this select trim command trim this line trim this lines like this Now we just we can convert this line like this and select trim command. We can trim this axis line here like this. Now we can see this radius. 12.5 you can see here in this drawing here as we see this radius 12.5 so it's okay finish the sketch select extrude cat select this profile just now we're going to select 5 millimeter okay and now we are going to create hole here just select hole command select this surface and select this radius here and now change this to 15 millimeter and the length of this hole through all okay you see just like this now the last one we are going to create a cutout here which is this one here as we see so let's select this face create new sketch Draw a circle D 
this circle must attach this point here as you see here this point because this cutout will start from here down and up like this give a dimension 100 as we see in the drawing we see here we have from this line to this line 21.79 line from here give a dimension let's delete this line first then. or just we can create a line Like this define from here to here 21.79 like this and select this unnecessary line just before you trim this one extend line like this trim command trim this one and now our sketch is fully defined so select finish sketch select extrude cut and now select up to this face or surface here apply so it looks very good material you can select iron cast and assign color just I select this one see here 21.79 millimeter and we have this radius 50 millimeter so now our model is finished I hope you like this video and thank you for watching